Okay, so we're here at Queen Lidio Kalani Park today and I want to explain to you today about the significance, more of the fundamental reasons why we eat and how that teachings in Buddhism should help you understand the action we take and how we should really focus on how we eat every meal. But how many times do you eat normally per day? Most of us eat breakfast, lunch, and dinner. And within that three times that we eat a meal, how do we eat it? Do we eat with our family? Do you go out and eat with your friends? Or do you like lay down and watch TV while you're eating? Hey, what you looking at? But what the question is, are you concentrating on the food or are you concentrating on doing another thing, basically multitasking while you're eating? And I get a lot of questions um, as a Zen priest because when I was uh, doing my monastic training, we often would just sit and eat and we would like be silent and we wouldn't even show our facial expression about the taste of the food and people would question us are you really enjoying meal time and to that I like to say yes we are and in fact a lot more than perhaps you are doing with your family and I'm not saying that you shouldn't be enjoying food or the meal family that's important as well that you are enjoying the atmosphere and the environment while you're eating but the reason why we don't do anything besides just eat is because we're trying to give our full attention to the meal and this goes to the teachings of every single thing that we eat has life everything had life and and this is if you can think about any, anything you eat and you look at the the source of that food that you're eating once there was a life whether or not that was the obvious like meat you know cows birds chickens uh pork whatever pigs you know whatever that the source was to something even to like plants um flowers, you know, herbs, vegetables, fruit, everything that was produced in this world as a, some sort of life that was involved in that making of that, the thing that we're eating. So when we, everything that we take in our body once had life. And in order for us to live another day, we need to absorb the life energy and that life energy is can only be gained through eating another life and that's the reality of eating and when we understand to that core point of eating that's why the teachings is trying to tell us that we should be having our conversation with the food with the source that we're eating and take full attention to that not multitasking doing other things but really focus on appreciating that life that we are about to have and that's why when we eat we try to listen to the sound it makes we listen to how the utensils hit each other creating that vibes of noise the sound but every time you chew you hear something and that sound is probably the last sound that food is going to make before it gets absorbed into your stomach and into your body as another form of life that chains and interacts with yours. So hearing each and every single one of those sound and appreciating how valuable that life is to you, then you can truly understand that living each moment really means that you're taking part in that second by second, moment by moment. And that's so important in trying to live the moment 
taking action in the moment and respecting that moment and truly appreciating the, the life that we have but also appreciating the life that we are about to take away. So I hope that kind of clears the reason why we don't speak or you know we eat in silence but most importantly I hope that what you can take home today is that the process of eating is about taking life away and it doesn't matter what you're eating and that's why I kind of disagree with people who say things like if you're a monk you know or you're a priest why are you eating meat it doesn't matter to me I have no difference between eating meat eating fish, eating plants, eating fruit. Everything to me is life. And there's no separation. There's nothing, there's, every life is equal. And therefore, by accepting that I'm already taking life away, it doesn't matter what type of life I'm taking away. All that matters to me is, am I appreciating the life so that my life can live another day? And I hope that will be the same for you and the next meal you take try try eating in silence and let me know in comments below or how you thought about it were you able to have the conversation you have with the food and be able to express your gratitude to the food that you just ate okay well thank you very much and i hope if you like these kind of uh topics please let me know in the comments uh, comment section below or and subscribe and like and please share if this was something meaningful to you thank you and we'll see you at the next episode